What the? Nacho saved it. Woo! I almost hold that. <laughs> what happened? What? That was crazy. This morning, we had to wake up super early to get ready for the day. We stopped by the Golden Gate Bridge last night just so I can take a couple shots of the bridge because we weren't going to spend a day in San Francisco that long. So I really wanted to take that shot. I didn't really know the area that well. Haven't been to San Francisco that many times, but I still managed to take a couple shots. The reason why we were up so early was because we were going on a hot air balloon. That's right. A hot air balloon. It's so tiny. But yeah. So, pretty much a private, right? Yeah, that's yeah. black and white. Thank you. Yeah, beautiful. Oh, welcome you aboard. Ladies Go ahead. first. Here's your phone. So it's one foot, two foot. Grab on, swing that first leg over, have a seat, land on your feet. If you don't, we'll fix you. Right, here we go. One and two. Grab anywhere. You can grab Jose. Have a seat. Swing that other leg in, land on your feet. Watch your beautiful camera. Welcome ah. aboard, everybody! Daddy like a mountain goat. <laughs> there you go. Beautiful. Have a seat. Welcome aboard. I'm low key scared. Is this a bad time to say? Do you know the name of the balloon? Uh, Early morning erection. <laughs> Is it really? I was going to call it. Unless we land in elementary school, what? then we call it Woody. <laughs> so quickly, let's talk about high-speed landing positions, all right? Uh, when it, if, if it, if it happens, I don't think it will. But if we get going like faster than five, six, seven, eight miles an hour, nothing to worry about. We just need to be in a different position other than holding on to bend our knees. So your hands have to be empty. So anything you have in your hands, hand over to me. Uh, after I say high-speed landing position, then you're gonna put your back up against this wall. It'll be the op It'll be the same side of the skirt. You'll be looking no skirt. So we'll be traveling this way. Your backs will be up against this, this wall. You'll be facing the opposite direction of travel. You'll be bending down like about this, and then you'll be holding onto these rope right in front of you if you can. If not, just stay on this wall. And if we tip over, that's perfect position. Uh, you'll recline, and then uh, I'll pop out and get some cool photos of us in the crash position. <laughs> yeah, come on in. See a little bit of sky, you see the Velcro popping on? What? And then when he releases it, it's gonna seal with no Velcro and give us a little bit of a bounce. That's how yeah. you know we're ready to go. So now the what's keeping the pressure in place is all that positive pressure. So all that heat, all that, uh, all that hot air, it's pushing right on top of the center patch. So the center patch is actually a separate component from the rest of the balloon itself. Mm. So when I... Oh my God, we're, we're not on the ground no more. <laughs> I 
Okay, hold on to it because it's gonna. I'm gonna get so sweaty, it's gonna fall off. <laughs> oh my god, every time I look down. <laughs> it looks a little higher every time. <laughs> yeah. Wait, you see Napa from here? Uh, just so I don't the surgery, we will once we get a little higher. Yeah, I've never seen this before, so. I'm impressed with your balloon picking. <laughs> yeah. Like, okay, see you fog. I wouldn't even call it fog. Small ground layer. We also keep mental track as we're flying along, so as we were taking off, I don't know if we were paying attention, but everything was actually going back towards the north. Oh. So we kept climbing up. So There's a slight oh, sorry, shifting back up. So sometimes uh, we get close to them and because of evolution and most of them end up on a barbecue grill and you know no power power pain, um, they run away. And when they do that we call that lean beef. <laughs> sometimes as they're running away they fall over. We call that ground beef. Hey, that's uh, all the milk right there, right? Yeah. Man, you really abuse all the animals here. They're like family. <laughs> With all these clouds, I'm like, how do you know where our place was? <laughs> okay, look, look at this. I'm gonna switch. We're moving. Oh, it's a different view here. <laughs> <laughs> No, you see this. <laughs> oh. oh, look at this way. It doesn't look that way. You just come back here and look. <laughs> There's nothing on that side. It's so beautiful. It's, it's so gorgeous. <laughs> you dance to the birds. Yeah. See? <laughs> the next time you see. Do you have your headphones in? Where are you going? Like? Yeah. <laughs> 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 see? <laughs> it's like I think it is working. You got it. Cows! Exactly. Right there! Coming to the airport. There's a bunch of them right there. Do you hear them? What the? Nats are saved! Woo! I almost pulled out. <laughs> what happened? Oh, what? Okay. That was crazy! <laughs> Look at the cows just looking at us. I know, they're like, what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is hey that? guys! <laughs> Move over! <laughs> <laughs> you know they're like, fuck you, man. <laughs> <laughs> they're seriously just like, That one, you're like, oh. All the cows up there higher, they're in a pretty tent. Like, what is that thing flying? There he goes. <laughs> what do you guys call a uh, a cow with only three legs? Uh, Tri tip. What do you call a clown cow? <laughs> what? I was trying to think of jokes this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> Why carne asada? Carne? Like oh, carne. like carnival. <laughs> Bye. I did get it. Yeah, I was surfing again. Look at that. Look at that. The shadow is pretty dope. Hi. 
Yes, I arrived at this one place uh, near Golden Gate Bridge where a lot of people actually do take pictures here. Looks pretty nice, but right in midday at 12 p.m., it's actually too bright and everything is pretty much blown out. So I couldn't find any really good shot without having like the water blown out. It's a lot of people there, but it's a really nice spot and I can see how good it would be if it was like at nighttime or when the sun sets or even in the morning. We have a little bit left and then the winery, winery, a couple of winery and then a, a good night rest and then nine hour drive. That should be fun. What you think of the Golden Gate Bridge? Yeah. Told you.